Hey y'all, Space Shed Dipper here. I have to tell you, after a long, hot, sunburnt day, Stoker's Long Cut Mint is the best way to go. Or any type of mint for that, uh, that matter. Or that fact, or for that fact. Um, if I sound stupid saying that, I'm really sorry. I've been up since 5 a.m. And the sun and swimming and all that's got me beat. But I had fun today. I went to my cousin's house because he was at, he, him and his wife were having a barbecue. They invited my great grandma, great grandpa, my grandma, my grand, well, I call him Mama and Papa, and my aunt, uncle, um, my other cousin's wife, but um, my cousin couldn't make it because he was out on a ship run. But my cousin that was um, having a barbecue, me, him, his wife, my other cousin's wife, their two kids, and my aunt, and the cousin that, uh, that hosted the whole thing, his wife's dad, we all played volleyball, and I won three games of volley volleyball, and I was like, what the fuck? It's been years since I played this game and I'm like doing this good, so yeah, I was like, I was fucking excited, dude. And I actually carried this knife today, um, a little um, saw buster from um, Case Double X or the Case Double X Saw Buster Junior. And I showed my great grandfather this knife because he he loves these older knives and. Then this is a traditional style knife. He's like, ooh, that's a dandy. Because that, he'll always say that. And that's what I love about him. He's himself. No, thank you. But, um, that's what I love about him. He's, um, he's very religious. So I gotta watch. Like, I can't really cuss around him. But, hey, I do that respect for him. I'm not going to say, you know what, fuck this, fuck that, in front of him, because that's disrespectful all in itself. But when he says something's a dandy, you know he likes it. And he said, this is a, he basically said this was a nice, ni nice knife. And I told him, I said, hey, I only paid $27.97 for it. And he's like, well, that's not a bad price, which, he's up there in age, I mean, I try and spend as much time with them as I can because I know that they're not going to be here for much longer. Sorry if I start crying. It's just, I only get the same once a year. So, yeah. And I mean, I should do it more often. Like, this year I'm going to try. While I'm up here, I'm going to try and spend as much time with them as I can because you just never know. But, um, sorry for the little emotional moment. But, um, that's um, another thing that I wanted to tell y'all is about the barbecue and all that. And I got sunburned and that this is a good dip for a long, after a long hot day out in the sun. Um, <clears throat> it may look like I'm fat. I'm really not. I have my height to go with it. But I am starting to work out, and I've been working out uh, for a couple weeks before I got here, and then today I got to work out playing volleyball um, and whatnot, or jumping in the pool, and just doing different shit. Like, if, say, if we hit the ball out, I would climb out of the, on the side and use my arms to push myself up, so I gave my arms a workout. So, yeah. I'm going to just show you a little bit of what muscle I do have, because a lot of people tell me, oh, you're fat, blah, 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 you're fat ass, you fucking fat ass, and all that, and I'm not really fat. I mean, you can look at my arms and tell I'm not fat. I mean, look at my triceps. It took me a long time to get my triceps to where they're at. And that's probably about a little bit of muscle I have besides my arms, and then my forearms. I definitely have strong legs. My legs are my strongest point of my body. And the reason being, well, I do a lot of kicking. So, well, not only that, 
I have to lift with my legs when I'm picking up speaker boxes and stuff. But say is an instance, say if I don't have a knife on me and somebody's trying to fight me or something, I have more power in my legs and I have a lot of power in my arms, but I have more power in my legs because of my calves and and my um, hips and whatnot and my thigh. I work those out a lot more than what I do my arms because say in another instance, say if I gotta get away from somebody that's trying to harm me, I can run a little bit faster. And that's another reason why I stopped smoking is because, well, as you smoke, as shit fills up in your lungs, and your lungs start to get, uh, say, decay over time due to smoking, I mean, when you try to run, you just run out of breath a lot faster than someone who's never smoked in their life. But, um, yeah, so don't take me um, flexing my arms and stuff as being a douchebag because... I'm not here to compete. I'm just here to um, show y'all that I do try and keep myself in shape. I mean, I don't know if you can see that. I mean, this arm is a little bit bigger. I don't know why. I actually know this arm is a little bit bigger right here. Your um, your um, dominant arm is always going to be a little bit bigger. And your non-dominant, for the simple fact, your dominant arm will always be stronger, and you can do more with it. So yeah, I mean, other than that, I'm pretty strong as it is, but I do try and keep myself in shape, especially during the summer times, just because I sweat a lot and it's helping me lose weight. I mean, as you can see, I'm not really fat. Um, and to the people who say I'm fat, yeah, I have a little bit of weight with me, but I'm also five foot six and 150 pounds. So to me, that's not that big. Another thing, I have thyroid problems. So my thyroids actually affect my weight, but somehow, over the past few years, I stopped taking my thyroid medicine. And my thyroid, believe it or not, actually corrected herself. So I'm staying between 150 and 160, so about 155. And that's a goal for me. That's where I want to be at for my height is 155. I don't want to be a heavyweight because I don't have the height to go with it. I think it could be, but what's the point? So yeah. Um, like I said, don't take this video as me to be in a douchebag when I'm showing you my triceps, biceps, and whatnot. Um, I would show you my legs, but I don't feel like standing up right now, so yeah, this is Base Editor signing out.